Hello and welcome. My name is Lonnie and I've got a new bookshelf tour for you today. So let's get this started. As I just said, I'm going to be showing you guys my new bookshelf and my new bookcase and how I have arranged everything this time around. So this is the view as of right now of my little reading corner. I have my reading chair with my Hufflepuff pillow from the World of Wizardry Geek Gear box and then my Chamber of Secrets Ford Angela, is that what it's called? Um, car and Hedwig that my friend's mom made. Then I have to the right of my bookshelf all my different subscription boxes that I have chosen to keep and yes they are all geek gear with the exception of the top one and that one's Loot Crate. I have my Marauders map from one of my best friends and then over here is another geek gear print that is framed. I hope to eventually put some Harry Potter pictures on the two blank walls around my bookshelf. So up here on the window ledge I have my bow truckle, a piggy bank, a bird, some prints, um, yep, more money, a Baymax, and my Thunderbird. I also have these two soot sprites. The top shelf of my bookcase consists of bookmarks, my Hermione doll, um, a box that's supposed to be like the Quibbler with Luna Spectra Specs, a Time Turner necklace, Harry Potter keychain, Deathly Hollows um, watch, some tea from Riddle's Tea Shops, boxes of Birdie Bot's Every Flavored Beans, a chocolate frog box with some more Harry Potter jewelry, and a Helga Hufflepuff card, Sorcerer's Stone, Felix Felici Felicis, Felix Felis, I can't say that word, but Liquid Luck, some bumper stickers, a little Dobby keychain, a Hufflepuff postcard, and then my little tribute to Doctor Who, my TARDIS phone case, and my 10th Doctor's, um, or I guess 9th and 10th Doctor's screwdriver. I have a dream catcher that I got at the Four Corners in the U.S., which is where, what is it, Colorado, Utah, New Mexico, and Arizona, they all meet, um, four corners of them meet together. Then I have my Wizards Wanted poster that I got at the Harry Potter and the Cursed Child midnight release party. I have a Pigwidgeon that I got from Loot Crate. And then my World of Wizardry cookbook from the Geek Gear box. Then my first pops, I have a Newt and a Tina. Then behind them, I have a Harry Potter tin. Then as we come over here, I have my Hufflepuff house version of Philosopher's Stone. Then my US cover. Then two copies of The Tale of Beetle, Beetle the Bard, US and UK. I have Harry with his in his Quidditch ropes. I have a Happy Birthday Harry patch. And a Ron Weasley in his um, Yule Ball outfit. Then all of my UK version copies of Harry Potter. Some not really Harry Potter glasses. I actually got those to be um, Where's Waldo for Halloween one year. But they work with Harry Potter. Then a Movies Magic Book Volume 2. And then my three copies of Harry Potter, the illustrated editions, but like deluxe. So they are massive and they come in these really hefty um, cases. Then all of my uh, enamel pins, most of them Harry Potter, some of them Disney, and one of them Ed Sheeran. <laughs> so next shelf, this is full of, so from 
these books right here are all books that I have finished reading. Um, I've read all of them. Some of them I have read a couple times. Then I have a little Hufflepuff Owl and my Niffler. Then all the books from here over, from here over, are series that I've read the first book or the first and second book, but I haven't finished the series. Then I have a Neville and Ron trading card set. Not really a set, but like they're Neville and Ron trading cards that I got at either Denver or Utah Comic Con. And then behind that, I have Forgotten Fitzgerald, which is just a whole bunch of short stories by F. Scott Fitzgerald. And then two Jodie Picoult books that I have yet to get to. Then my little metal building works of Hagrid's Hut. On my bottom shelf, these are books that I have not read yet. And over here, I have a candle that I got for Christmas that says little moments make big days. Then a Hogwarts house candle from Geek Gear. This has all of my wands in it. I got it at, I got Ron's wand in that at Denver Comic Con. And with Ron's wand, I also have Newt Scamander's wand. And then over here, I have a Scabbers and a Hedwig. And that is my bookcase. Let's swing over to Matthew's bookcase really fast. So Matthew's bookcase is made up primarily of manga. Um, some don't start at the beginning because that's where he ended up leaving like with the um the tv show and then he picked up where the tv show left off and then he has some figures and just more manga and then i haven't figured out what i'm going to do with this yet but these are the comics i got for free comic book day and then I also got the first three volumes of Saga. And there's not any room on my bookshelf for these, so I'm starting to take over some space on Matthew's bookshelf. So that is my new updated bookshelf tour. I guess that's it. So thank you so much for stopping by and watching this video. And as you leave here today, I hope you leave with peace in your thoughts, peace in your words, and peace in your heart. Bye. Oops. <laughs> yeah.